um, they're in different businesses. I mean, the big tech invested in new services. Um, they created new needs of consumers. They created a whole new industry. Their job is not to create infrastructure. We have to understand that the key factor that made the internet and all related technologies such a success was that it, it, that it created a common communication infrastructure for any kind of services. Before the internet, if we remember 20, 30 years back, if you wanted to offer a one-to-one -one service, voice service, like telephone, you would need to create your own infrastructure, lay cables, build telephone exchanges, and so on. You would even have to manufacture your own devices like telephones. And if you wanted to set up a music service, you would need to create another separate infrastructure, the radio station, transmission towers, manufacture separate devices, like the radios our grandmothers are still listening to, and likewise for the TV. So before the internet, we could count all the communication services on the fingers of one, maybe two hands, and internet changed all that because communication was supposed to be digital, only one infrastructure to transfer digital information is needed, and only devices that can handle digital information are needed. You can get all the services on one or two devices, like a computer or a mobile phone. So the infrastructure was there, and anyone with an idea of a service could create it. And we now have millions of apps that provide useful tools to happy users. This model dies if service providers have to start setting up or contributing to infrastructure. 